cancel. Sweezy. Now we're finally made to our last question. What video game would work well as a movie? So, okay. So yeah, this is a good one. They already made the Mario. They, they made a Mario movie, which was like how long it took for them to make, you know, they made more Mario movies and Mario shows before and those were ass. But like the, I think the Illumination one, surprisingly good. It's It was surprisingly good for a Mario movie. And like as a fan of Mario games... Like, it, they give you a lot of little Easter eggs and stuff like that to, like, that you can enjoy. Because I'm pretty sure I play, like, almost, I'm p- pretty much played every Mario game for the most part. And uh, the the fact that, you know, little Easter eggs here and there that you can enjoy, like, uh, Chunky in the, uh, when then there's the Donkey Kong. Then there's Chunky. He's dead. <laughs> DK. Donkey Kong. So, stuff like that. So, uh, I'm thinking about games. Star Wars Lego. They should make that into a movie. No. Um, the first one that comes to mind, and I'll just I'll just leave it at that. I'm just going to go with this one. The first one that comes to mind. A Legend of Zelda game. That would be fucking insane. The thing is, though, because I think I would love for a, you know, a Nintendo cinematic universe, like, you know, Illumination. But I don't know if, like, the Illumination kid friendly, you know, like kids movie studio would be the right fit for a Zelda show. It would need either need to be live action, like, uh, you know, like kind of like the Witcher, but I don't want it as gritty. I want it to still feel cause like Zelda games, like, you know, you play it and it was like, Oh, something bad happened. But however, like the world doesn't seem like so dark and gloomy and moody. So, like, there would need to be some bright colors and stuff like that. I mean, I would personally love a Zelda movie in the, kind of in, like, the animation styles like that, uh, Tears of the Kingdom and Breath of the Wild. I would fucking love that. But I think live action could work good as well. Uh, but I think if it's an animation style, it needs to be, like, a really cool, unique kind of animation style. Basically, like, the games already are. Uh, at least the current games they're making. But, uh, yeah, I would I would absolutely love... Not even I'm not even you know I'm tech I say I'm not a big Zelda fan, but Tears of the Kingdom is I think it's probably made my list of top favorite games of all time. But there's so much cool Zelda lore to get into. It would work so well. I think it would work better as like a a series, you know. But I don't know how long. I don't know. I think maybe a movie, a movie would be good too. But a nice a nice long ass movie. Yeah, I would need to be two and a half hours. I I would want it to be two and a half hours. I want them to fit a lot into it. Because one of the nice things about the Zelda games is it really just makes you take your time on on stuff like that, too. You know, like, you're going to climb a wall. It's going to take a couple minutes, but you'll get up there. But, like, you know, you got to take your time and go slow. And I think something like that would be... Oh, dude, a Zack Snyder-directed Zelda movie? He would... Zack Snyder directing a Legend of Zelda movie... Dude, he kicked fucking ass at that, dude. Because even in the game, sometimes you do attacks and it goes into, like, slow motion. Like, if you're using the bow and it goes into slow motion, that would be so fucking bad. Dude, Zack Snyder, just tell him to not make it super edgy. But, like, make it, like, a PG-13 movie where it's, like, it's not really a kid's movie, but kids can see it, you know, with their parents, you know? And it's not, like, that bad. We, like, put a little bit of violence in the Dude, that would be, be fucking bitching, dude. Uh... Zelda game or Zelda movie? It'd be fucking awesome, dude. Thank you for watching this clip.